Let's see here. There's a new museum opening up in Dawnstar. The owner is asking me to hand out invitations to... Looks like that's it. Ancestors wouldn't want this, Silas. Why should I hide from it? This is my family's legacy. It's the past. Dead oaks on dead lips. Let it stay there. The museum is opening, Athena. I beg you, don't go into Silas's museum. <coughs> Silas comes from one of the oldest families in Dawnstar. They have a complicated history. Several of his ancestors belonged to the Mythic Dawn, the cult that almost destroyed Tamriel. His family's involvement was only found out well after the crisis had died down, but it still ruined their reputation. They were outcasts. And now Silas is back, and this museum to the Mythic Dawn is his way of trying to rebuild his family's pride. It's misguided. Not a student of history, I see. It's for the best. They're a group that should be forgotten. The only thing you need to know is that they almost destroyed the world. And they were stopped. A long time ago. That and museum here comes is a my mistake. first visitor. The Museum of the Mythic Dawn is open, friend. Yes. My collection of artifacts from a group that toppled an empire. Why don't you come in? You can browse the displays and we can talk. I have a job you look perfect for. Let's talk inside. Feel free to look around. Come talk to me when you're ready to discuss that job I mentioned. The ta Those robes were worn during the Mythic Dawn secret meetings, where they plotted to bring the Daedra Mehrunes Dagon into Tamriel. Each bolt of yarn used to make the robe was colored with a dye made from sacrificial blood. That burned paper is all that remains of the fabled Mysterium Xarxes, the blasphemous book written by Mehrunes Dagon himself. It's said that Mankar Cameron used the book to open a portal to a paradise where all his followers would live forever. The commentaries on the Mysterium Xarxes were written by the Mythic Dawn cult leader, Mankar Cameron. He promised a paradise awaited his followers when they died, that they would be reborn by Merun's Dagon's side. Did you have any questions about the museum, or would you rather talk business? They were worshippers of Mehrunes Dagon, the Daedric Lord of Destruction and Change. The Mythic Dawn killed Uriel Septim VII and his heirs, triggering the events that led to the Oblivion Crisis when the Daedra invaded Tamriel. It's no secret that my family were once members of the Mythic Dawn. One of my forefathers was even chosen to assassinate Uriel Septim himself. We hid from our past for years, became tradesmen, people of coin and influence. But I realized that the Mythic Dawn's importance, our importance, to history cannot be denied. I'll see everyone in Tamriel remember that for a moment, we held the fate of the world in our hands, for good or ill. Ah, an excellent question. Merun's Dagon is the Daedric Lord of Change, Destruction, and Ambition. Dagon's mythic Dawn cult killed the Septim Dynasty and opened the Oblivion Gates into Tamriel. They called it the Oblivion Crisis. A little history first. After the Oblivion Crisis, a number of groups cropped up dedicated to wiping out the remnants of the mythic Dawn. One of these groups found Merun's razor, the artifact of Dagon, 
They split it into three fragments and pledged to keep them apart forever. That was almost 150 years ago, and the pieces are still being kept by the descendants of that group. And they're right here, in Skyrim. At least two of the owners, Gonzal and Draskua, are dangerous marauders. And the third owner, Jorgen. I only know he lives in Morthal. Here are my notes about them. I'll gladly pay you for getting the pieces any way you can. No questions asked. Good luck finding the fragments. Heard they're reforming the Dawn Guard. Vampire hunters or something in the old fort near Riften. Might consider. Opening up my cell. Just want to be. Left. Don't know what you're talking about, stranger. I've heard of him. My father had suspicions about his connection to the mythic Don. Guess they were true. I don't need this. My family wasted eight generations keeping that razor safe from a dead cult. As far as I care, I can stay locked in my house. I don't care, but my ancestors do. You can't have it. You want to fight? You got it. Come on. What you're made of? Fine. The hilt is in the chest inside my house. Here are the keys. Take that damn thing and go. The mi I just want to be left alone to do my job. And to enjoy what little free time I have when I have it. Alright then. Yeah. 
for me. Do you?
I've got your back. I am so <laughs> What is it? Do you have... All at once? You're efficient. I like that. Here's your reward. Finally, all the pieces of Merun's razor are in my hands. It's time I let you in on something. There's a fourth piece, that scabbard in the display case, built to house the razor. And there's more. I know how to put all the pieces together. We just need to take them to Dagon's shrine, and contact the Lord of Change directly. Ever since I was a boy, I felt this strange sense of destiny surrounding the Mythic Dawn cult. And now I know what it is. Don't you see? Fate has led you to me and to the pieces. Dagon has to answer our call. We're so close. I'll meet you at the shrine. I'll meet you at the shrine. Place the pieces on the altar, and Dagon should speak to us. Merun's Dagon, the Lord of Change. We have brought your razor to you. We beg you, please, bring the blade's full glory to Tamriel again. It's not working. Why don't you give it a try? Just put your hands on the altar. <laughs> You, mortal, you are worthy of speaking to. You have claimed the pieces of my razor. It has been an amusing game to witness. But Dagon does not declare a winner while there is a pawn on the board. Kill Silas. He and his family have served their purpose. Kill him. Take your rightful place as my champion, or I will crush you. Wait, wait! Don't kill me! There's another way. I can take the pieces back to my museum, seal them in a display case. You get a generous amount of gold, I get to complete my collection, and nobody has to die. Fine. I'm not dying without a fight. Never should have come.
I am pleased, mortal. I will give you my razor. Use it to wreak havoc on Tamriel. You have been a worthy tool. Fill the world with destruction in my name. Place your hands on my altar one last time, and you will witness the power of Merun's Dagon for yourself. Before you go, mortal, one final challenge. <laughs> Lead on. Oh. 